Ow, damn it. Admittedly, I'm usually more about the high ABV alcohol stuff, or at least I have been in the past. When it comes to summer, I don't really care. Just give me a drinkable, frosty situation and I'm good. Oh my God, it hits the spot. Damn. Today is a haul. I haven't done a haul in quite some, actually a really long time, I think. I have a little bit of PR, uh, a few things that I bought myself. I'm sorry, I'm sorry to alarm you. Editing Kate is here with her bed head to tell you that she could not get her words out when she was filming this. This video is in partnership with Ana Luisa. Oh my God, can I talk? Okay, back to the video. I know I always say this, but Ana Luisa really does have something for everyone. You know, they have more classic pieces, um, sort of like daintier, finer pieces, but they also have sort of more eclectic style pieces so you can like functify. So I just, can't say enough about Ana Luisa and also their price point is fantastic, especially for the quality you're getting. All of the metals they use are recycled. They're a totally sustainable jewelry brand. And on top of it, they have been a vocally pro-choice brand, which I am so, so happy about. Come through Ana Luisa. I have so many Ana Luisa uh, jewelry pieces now and so many of them look like the day they arrived. I mean, the jewelry has held up beautifully. Of course, you have to take care of it. I do wanna let you guys know that I always have a 10% off code with Ana Luisa, and that is Kate10. So that will get you 10% off site-wide, and I'm gonna link all of that down below in the description box. But yeah, I just continue to be so impressed. So let me show you some of the pieces that they sent me this month. The first piece I wanna get started with are these Gigia Gorgeous hoops. I cannot get over these. I love hoops. I have quite a few pairs and I have to say I think these might be my favorite pair. So the Tia Medium Gold hoops are $59. I love the thickness of these. I love the fact that they have this really high polished texture to them. So they really draw your eye and they really are a statement piece but they're also a little bit understated too. They're kind of like a Goldilocks hoop. So these are coated with a thick 14 karat gold layer and feature hypoallergenic titanium posts and are comfortable to wear all day long, which I really wanna drive that home because I have little teeny tiny lobes and they don't hold a lot of weight. So I'm very, very cognizant of, you know, how lightweight my earrings need to be. I can barely feel these, these are perfection. So the next earrings I wanna talk about are these little teeny tiny cute guys, they're called Mava. So these retail for $39 and I know they don't look like much, but this is my favorite kind of stud because it's a negative space stud. There's just something that again, really draws the eye to that and I love to layer with these. I also love this if you have any piercings that are like inside your ear, like this one right here, I think this stud would look so, so cool. It's just like a little blingy circle inside your ear. Okay, and the third earrings are an example of something that's a little bit like funkier and more eclectic, a little pop of color, which I love. These are called the Hannah Hibiscus Pink, and oh God, I just love the color combo on these. These are $75. Like if that doesn't say summertime fun, I'm sorry, I don't know what does, but I am gonna put my hoops back in because I have to say, I just love these so, so much. And I feel like I'm gonna be wearing the hell out of these year round. Thank you so much to Ana Luisa for partnering with me on this video. Again, my code is always in my description box. It is Kate10 and that is gonna get you 10% off. So now we're gonna get into all the goodies that I have acquired over the last few weeks. So before we get going, I just want to mention that I actually had a lot more to show you than I'm going to end up showing you today. And the reason for that is that several of the brands that, that sent me PR just have not been vocal in regard to Roe v. Wade being overturned um, and women's rights, people who have uteruses rights being taken away. I'm upset, you know? I mean, I have so much incredible makeup from brands I love. Uh, I have so much amazing makeup that I'm receiving that I wanna try, that I wanna use, that I wanna show you guys. But I have to be honest with you, I just don't feel comfortable with that. I'm not gonna stand here and say that I stand uh, for women's rights, for abortion rights, that I'm pro-choice, and then actively talk about and promote brands and give airtime to brands who are not being vocal themselves. That just feels like I'm kind of talking out of both sides of my mouth, and I just, 
I just don't really want to do it. I have some incredible boxes from uh, Elemis, from uh, ColourPop, from this new brand called Exponent, or it's new to me at least, Exponent Skincare, I believe. I have a box from City Beauty. I would love to show you all of that. I really wanted to. I'm not going to for the reasons I just stated. I'm just gonna set those aside for now and I guess, <laughs> I don't know, I guess wait until those brands decide that they want to support the people who make up most of their consumer base. The brands I am gonna show you, they're top notch. First, we're starting out with Rare Beauty and this is officially the most gorgeous piece of PR I have ever received. I mean, this is a piece of art. Like, and if you could feel it, oh my God, it is so, just satisfying and matte and just so high qual. And then we have this like gorgeous giant pamphlet, which is also a work of art that explains all of the products. So what we're looking at here is the Kind Words Matte Lip Liner and the Kind Words Matte Lipstick. This is it. They sent me the entire collection. I squealed. This is just so above and beyond. Up here we have the Kind Words Matte Lip Liners, which retail for $15 a piece. And these are smooth glide, ultra creamy, matte color, waterproof, won't smudge, feather or fade, and complete with a built-in sharpener. And then we have the Kind Words Matte Lipsticks down here, and these are $20 a piece. And these are high pigment, one swipe color, cushiony, comfortable all day wear, and weightless with a soft matte finish. This is just incredible. Thank you so much to Rare Beauty. I just love this brand so much. I love Selena Gomez. I love everything it stands for. Which one do I choose? I think I'm gonna go with, I'm gonna go with the shade Fun. Wait, complete with built-in sharpener. Where's the sharpener? Oh, yeah, that's a teeny tiny little baby sharpener. Okay, so this is the shade Fun right there. Very, very glidey, I will say. Very, very comfortable so far. Mmm, ooh, that's gorgeous. Kind of giving me like muted peachy orangey vibes. Very like pumpkin spice. Okay, so that feels great. Not mad about that lip liner. And then we're gonna try out the lipstick and look at this cool container. You push it and it comes out and then you push it back in. That is so cool. And that is the swatch, went on like a damn dream. I just wanna show you what exactly it looks like in the bullet before I apply it. Mm. That's gorgeous. And yeah, I mean, it feels like a very comfortable, velvety, almost cream lipstick, but it's matte. This is the perfect product to use your finger to diffuse it and give you kind of that blurred look too. Kind of buffing it out with my finger. Oh, I love this. Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. I think I'm gonna keep this lip color on for the rest of the video. I was thinking, oh, maybe I'll go back to what I had, but uh, no, I think I'm good. I am so excited to add these to my collection. Again, thank you so much to Rare Beauty for sending me the entire kit and caboodle. Persona sent me their brand new blush dream sticks. Now, you know, the lip liner and the lipstick was really easy for me to like, just kind of throw on and show you. I'm not gonna be able to do that with everything today because I already have a full face of makeup, but don't you worry there will be trying to make a videos coming up. So this is a multi-use cream blush stick for cheeks and lips. It retails for $26. They've sent me all three shades and it is available at Persona and at Ulta. So I'm gonna swatch all of these for you starting with I think one of their most popular blush shades which is the shade Bubble. This is a very beautiful, cool tone, hot pink shade. And that is how it applies. Look at that. And I love how it's almost like a watercolor, like a sheer watercolor. It feels very buttery. It does feel dewy. Obviously I can't tell you how it sets down today. Then we have the shade Teddy, which is an apricot nude, which would be perfect for my look today, right? I'm really doing these swatches very well, but whatever. Whoa, that really is a perfect fall shade and does actually match this lipstick perfectly. Then we have a very, very bold shade. This is the shade Kiss, which is a cherry red. Wow, 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 wow. This is a great shade range, I have to say. These are all very, very different shades and I can see myself using them for totally different looks. Wow, I cannot wait to dig into these and actually use them 
thank you so much to Persona Cosmetics because these are like right at my alley. Look at this. If this isn't the biggest box you've ever seen, I don't know what is. Holy hell, Halsey. I'm scared to like stand it up for fear that everything is gonna fall out. But is that not just insanity? I cannot wait to try this. I've heard so many great things about this brand. I feel like this is a whole video or something in and of itself. There's so much to dig into here and I'm not gonna do it today, but thank you so much to About Face Beauty for sending this my way. Cannot wait to try this. So now that we got the the Rare Beauty and the About Face out of the way, those boxes, imagine how much space they're taking up in this apartment. A lot. Okay, so moving on to some smaller things that I can actually just fit onto my counter space and talk about. And also I've already like unboxed these things because I just, I couldn't keep my hands off them, okay? This is the Youth to the People, brand new. Brand spanking new, this came out like, I wanna say, a couple days ago. They're Polypeptide 121 Future Cream. Strengthen and firm and moisturize plant proteins and biotech collagen. Okay, so I'm going straight to the Youth of the People website for this just to give you the lowdown. This is intensely moisturizing cream with peptides, plant proteins, and ceramides that replenishes critical moisture for up to 24 hours and helps visibly firm, reduce the look of fine lines and wrinkles, and strengthen the skin's moisture barrier. It has Polypeptide 120 and you're like, what the hell is that? Same. It's bio-designed vegan collagen peptide that's comprised of 180 plus amino acids. I obviously have not been using this that long. They sent this to me, I want to say maybe like a week and a half ago, something like that. And I have been using it regularly and I already love it. I put this on this morning. Um, I did my You to the People cleanser and then I just went in with this. I Marco Poloed Michelle and I was like, Look at my skin. <laughs> Look at my skin, isn't it so good? No, but it really looked kind of incredible and it's because of this. I was like, wow, I am kind of blown away. So this is something I'm gonna keep using. Obviously I can't like tell you full effects after I've only been using something for a week or so. But what I can tell you is I'm already in love. It is a cushiony lightweight cream and it is fragrance free. That is something I want to point out because I know that is a big deal to some people and it really is. There's, there's not a damn bit of scent in there. I have a code that like magically always works for youth of the people. Right now it still works and it is more youth. So if you use the code more youth at checkout, it will get you 20% off site-wide of youth of the people. Also everything I'm talking about here today, all the codes and my affiliate links will be down below in the description box. And that just means if you shop through my links that I get a small commission for that. I feel like this is gonna be like a holy grail run do not walk situation for me. I'm really loving this as a day and a night moisturizer. So moving on to an eyeshadow that I've seen so many people talk about and I was like, fine, fine. I think Khaki was the last person I saw and I was like, I'm getting it. I've got to get it. This is the Kaja. Oh my God. It has like the longest name on earth and it's not on here, but it's like the beauty bento blendy bouncy eyeshadow stack. Um, but anyway, this is in the shade Orange Blossom and you get this stack of three shadows and these are some of the most gorgeous shimmery eyeshadows I've ever seen. I actually have one of them on my eyes today, which I'll show you in a second. This is the top shade and I will swatch them for you. You have to like shimmer, but my God, is that not just like what's even happening? So I used that in a live stream and it was gorgeous. These are so highly blendable. I apply them with my finger and then I just go in with a flurfy brush and just like make it even shinier and pearlize it more and just smooth it out. Perfection. This is the middle shade in the stack. Look at that. This is the shade I'm wearing on my lids today that right there. Yeah. So those are the three shades in the orange blossom stack. I have yet to use the one in the middle, but don't you worry, I'm going to. It's going to be a Luke. If you're looking for like beautiful one and done shades, you can use them all together, but like I think they're interesting and gorgeous enough on their own that like why even bother? Last but certainly not least, certainly not least, because this is like you know what these should have gone in? These deserved to go in the makeup so good I needed more video because that's exactly what I did. I had a couple of these and I was like, I'm obsessed. I'm gonna go buy more. These are the Tower 28 Shine On Jelly Lip Glosses. I got the shade XOXO, which like, how could I not? Just a beautiful sheer berry. 
So that is XOXO. What? And then this, I believe, is their newest shade. This is called Pistachio, and it's just a, re a really beautiful sort of like, I don't know how they describe it, but it is a your lips but better situation. It gives you just that like, well, I'm gonna bring up Michelle again because she's a big fan of those like plumped, but like your lips, but better kind of natural looking lip glosses. That's exactly what this is. So definitely gonna be using more of these coming up. I am tempted to throw a gloss on, but you know what? I'm not going to because I am loving this look on its own. I don't think it needs anything else. Okay guys, so that wraps up this haul video. Thank you so much for joining me. I'm really, really excited this time around to like play with all the things I just showed you. As I said before, everything is gonna be linked down below and please make sure to check out Ana Luisa, check out those uh, jewelry pieces I showed you and use my code. Use that K10 and get your 10% off. As always, you guys are the best. Please stay safe out there and cheers till next time. Bye. Mm. <sighs>